वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम वन डैश एट जीरो दिस प्रॉब्लम इज टेकन फ्रॉम चैप्टर नंबर वन दैट इज स्ट्रेस एंड बुक नेम इज मैकेनिक्स ऑफ मटीरियल बाय आर सी हिबलर सो स्टेटमेंट इज द थ्रस्ट बेरिंग कंसिस्ट ऑफ अ सर्कुलर कॉलर ए फिक्स टू अ शॉफ्ट बी डिटरमाइन द मैक्सिमम एक्जियल फोर्स पी दैट कैन बी अप्लाइड टू द शॉफ्ट सो दैट इट डज नॉट कॉज द शेयर स्ट्रेस अलॉन्ग सिलेंड्रिकल सर्फिस ए आर बी टू एक्सीड अलाउेबल शेयरिंग स्ट्रेस ऑफ वन सेवेंटी मेगा पास्कल सो यू कैन सी दिस इज द थ्रस्ट बेरिंग सिलेंड्रिकल थ्रस्ट बेरिंग और सर्कुलर थ्रस्ट बेरिंग एंड दिस इज कॉलर ए विच इज फिक्सड विद दिस शॉफ्ट बी क्लियर एंड देर इज एक्सियल लोड अलॉन्ग द एक्सिस इज अप्लाइड ऑन दिस शॉफ्ट एंड इट इज गिवन दैट एट बी सिलेंड्रिकल सर्फिस बी एंड ए द स्ट्रेस शुड नॉट एक्सीड द 170 सेवेंटी मेगा पास्कल सो यू कैन सी दैट ड्यू टू दिस फोर्स देर विल बी अ शेयर फोर्स इन दैट विल अकर एट दिस रीजन क्लियर बिकॉज इट विल कॉज इट टू शेयर दिस पोर्शन एंड ड्यू टू दिस एक्जियल लोड इट विल ऑल्सो कॉज द शेयरिंग इन दिस रीजन एज वेल सो विल फाइंड द मैक्सिमम लोड दैट कैन बी अप्लाइड सो इट डज नॉट एक्सीड द अलाउेबल शेयरिंग स्ट्रेस ऑफ वन सेवेंटी मेगा पास्कल The data is already given, so let's start with the solution. So we'll calculate this P based on based on sharing stress along A. So you can see that due to this load, there will be a sharing at A. So this sharing stress will be equal to we know that allowable sharing stress is given which is equal to lo p divided by sharing area so what will be the sharing area so you can see this is a cylindrical surface clear so at a this area will be equal to this diameter pi into d will be the circumference of this portion clear and the thickness t which is 0. Point, uh, which is 35 mm clear so i will write this area p divided by sharing area is 30 is this diameter which is you can see 30 mm so in meter it is 0.03 and pi d clear and thickness is 35 mm which is 0.035 clear and we know that allowable sharing stress is 170 mega pascal so 170 into 10 to the power 6 is equal to this p which will cause sharing at a divided by pi into 0.03 multiply by 0.035 so from here what you will get you will get this p will be equal to 170 multiplied by 10 to the power 6 multiplied by pi multiplied by 0.03 multiplied by 0.035 clear and when you calculate it you will get p will be equal to 56 uh, 56100 000 newton and in kilo newton this p will be equal to Five six one kilo newton. So this P is based on is for A. This is A. You can see this is along A. This P is for along A. Now we will calculate this based this P force based on. uh sharing stress sharing stress along b so you can see this is b and here it may cause the sharing due to this load these two points may share so you can see that this is also a cylindrical surface so you can see this diameter is 58 mm so pi into d its diameter multiply by its thickness which is 20 mm will give you area so i can write it ta allowable is equal to p divided by a of b so p 
divided by area of B sharing area will be equal to pi into D is 58 millimeter which in meter is 0 0.058 and thickness is 20 millimeter so 0 0.02 meter and tile allowable is given as 170 megapascal so 170 into 10 raised to the power 6 is equal to P divided by pi multiplied by 0 0.058 multiply by 0 0.02 and you can get this p is 170 multiply by 10 to power 6 multiply by pi into 0 0.058 multiply by 0 0.02 and you will get this p will be equal to 620000 newton or you can say that p is equal to 620 kilo newton now you can see this is p along a and this p is for along p so what to choose is that our answer will we will choose choose p is equal to 561 kilo newton as largest or maximum axial load why because you can see that this is smaller and this is greater so it will be safer clear so what if i choose this one so let me discuss it also if you put uh, p in this formula tie allowable at a is equal to p divided by pi multiply by 0 0.03 into 0 0.035 clear so you can see that uh, p is 620 kilo newton into 10 to the power 3 divided by pi into 0 0.03 into 0 0.035 so you will get the allowable at a will be equal to 187.94 mega pascal and you can see we have been given that allowable sharing stress is 170 mega pascal so it will cause the failure so hence this will be this value will be the safer because if you put it in this formula your allow, allowable sharing stress at b will be less than allowable sharing stress so hence we will select this value and that is the answer of our this question that was all about this problem 1-80 i hope you have enjoyed this video and you have learned from it those who are new to my channel then subscribe it and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you can get notification about my latest videos also share my videos with your friends and help me in growing my channel further if you have any question you can ask me in comment section thank you for watching